What's up, the John Squad? This is John Pilling here, here on YouTube, and this is your YouTube World has a Champion, and I'm coming to my, my WWE SmackDown review for December 4th, 2018. So let's do the Shadow of the John Squad. So we kicked off WWE SmackDown Live with the contract signing for the Triple Threat Women SmackDown Championship. TLC and with Paige already in the ring. Paige welcomes out Asuka. Then she welcomes out Charlotte Flair. Then she welcomes out the man, the women's champion, Becky Lynch. Becky says we're making history and she um she plans on ma making the exact same thing. It doesn't matter to her. That's what she says. And she doesn't care. Charlotte then talks to Becky and tells her that she destroyed Ronda Rousey at Survival Series. And imagine what she will do to her at TLC. Asuka tells her that she beat her. Not, not, not Charlotte. That she beat Becky. And then... And that Becky beat her, and at TLC, she will beat Charlotte. You know, beat 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 Becky. So then, so then they all three argue, argue on, and Becky signs the contract, walks out, and leaves. Which I thought that was pretty funny. Then Oscar and Charlotte go at it, and they both sign the contract. Then Mandy Rose and Sonya Deville both come out, and Mandy Rose then cuts a promo to Paige, and then Mandy Rose talks to Charlotte Flair, and you know, and then Sonya Deville says about last week that it was a fluke how um, Oscar got the win last week in the Battle Royale, and then Paige makes a tag team match for right now between uh, between Mandy Rose and Sonya Deville versus Oscar and Charlotte Flair. And the first match we had on SmackDown was Mandy Rose and Sonya Deville versus Oscar and Charlotte Flair, and during the match, Becky Lynch comes out to comes out from the back and to come out and watch this match. So, so, and the winner of this match was Sonya Deville and Mandy Rose. I never expected that to happen. I like to see them win. But anyway, so then the second match we had on SmackDown was a triple threat match. One half of the New Day, Xavier Woods versus Cesaro. One half of the Bar versus one half of the Usos, Jey Uso. And the winner was... One half of the Usos, Jay Uso, Ooh, so that's right. The third match we had on SmackDown was the third match we had on SmackDown was Jeff Hardy versus Randy Orton. And during the match, Joe appears on the time trial and tells Jeff Hardy he's at a bar before Jeff Hardy was about to put Randy Orton through the announce table. But the winner of this match was Jeff Hardy. Then after the match, Samoa Joe makes fun of Jeff Hardy's past, you know, from his drinking problems past. And that's what Samoa Joe does. And just makes fun of Jeff Hardy's bad habits and past and tells him don't get pulled over and drive before you drink and drive and stuff. So that's what he does that's what basically that whole was thing is so then we had Miz TV and Car and before Miz can say his whole thing about Miz TV Carmilla and our true come out and interrupt Miz TV and do a dance break on the stage and then they leave and go to the back and then so the Miz he welcomes out the new WWE champion and the new Daniel Bryan and the Miz Ask him what what should he call him, and that's what he says, and and that he seems more confident now, and that and that he and that he is close to be a winner now, and that he was you know that he was never allowed to, and so Daniel Bryan talks about the. Old Daniel Bryan, no, Daniel Bryan talks about the old Daniel Bryan, and then all of a sudden is that, um, D Daniel Bryan talks about his dreams, and starts to say, fickle, on the microphone, fickle, fickle, on the microphone, and, on, and then talks about Alexander Hamilton, that's what it basically he talks about, then The Miz then talks to Daniel Bryan, and that told him what that he told him what to do that that's what he wanted him to do and then Daniel Bryan starts to yell at the fans all of a sudden so then Daniel Bryan throws the yes logo side plates you know the one one of one of these uh 
side plates, like one of these little things, the yes side plates onto the ground, takes them off and just throws them down on the ground, the yes side plates, and then all of a sudden is that AJ Styles comes out to the ring, and Daniel Bryan shoves the Miz right into AJ Styles, a AJ Styles beats up on The Miz, then AJ Styles goes and chase after The Miz, and then what happens next is that, you know, and then what happens next is that Darren Bryan goes into the ring, and then what happens next is that Darren Bryan escapes, and the AJ Styles gets a skull crushing finale, and then... 10 Miz TV, we have the main event on SmackDown we had was AJ Styles versus The Miz, and Daniel Bryan was out on commentary, but then the winner of this match was AJ Styles. After the match, Daniel, Daniel Bryan beats up on AJ Styles, uh, and beats up on, on his leg, you know, on his leg, and... And th 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 throws him into the post, then bounces his head off of the announce table, you know, p puts him in a submission hold, that's what Daniel Bryan does, and then he, and then he gets, and this keeps beating the heck out of AJ Styles, that's what Daniel Bryan keeps on doing, and then all of a sudden is, is that he, he gets on the microphone, the announcer is saying this, the, the announcer that introduces him is saying this, is that, Ladies and gentlemen, the new WWE Champion, the new Daniel Bryan. That's what he says. And then did, and then Daniel Bryan says, you don't approve of this. You don't approve of the new Daniel Bryan. You people don't approve of this and this. And then before SmackDown comes to an end, Daniel Bryan goes back in the ring, attacks the leg of AJ Styles and puts it in a submission hold. And that's how WWE SmackDown ends last night. Or WWE SmackDown Live ends last night. So what I thought about this SmackDown, I thought it was pretty okay last night. You know, lots of things happen off and on. But anyway, can't complain about the SmackDown episode still the same things, but next week we're getting a wrap battle between the Usos and the bar, you know, Seamus and Cesaro and the Usos, and the New Day are going to be the host, and then we're getting a WrestleMania rematch between Charlotte Flair and Asuka, so can't wait forward to that, and things are going to look good, so hopefully things turn out good, and yeah, so uh, once again, the John Squad, please like this video. Leave your comments down below and subscribe for more. You're all the best at John Squad. You're all one of a kind. I love each and every single one of you guys. And don't forget, when you subscribe, you become a champion here on this channel. And don't forget to tap that bell on your YouTube app so you never miss an upload on my videos. Peace out, the John Squad. And leave your comments down below. What, what, what was your favorite part in this episode of SmackDown? Peace.